the data is in my friends, AI is taken over and we have used all of that information to tell you how to score more goals. Let's go. What we're gonna give you are principles so that when you are in a situation, you can know exactly what to do and I'm gonna tell you why those things are the best things. Most goals are scored in the box. That's been the way it is and that's why we will focus on this to start off. Right here on this, you guys can see the angle that I'm at on the far side. Normally you have far post. The options available to you are to bend the ball and then to strike the ball low and hard here in this corner. Obviously, always shooting for the upper 90 makes sense, but in this option here, you have to do things in two touches. Everything in the box is two touch. These are the rules, all right? I'm giving you the rules. I didn't make the rules, but I can tell you what the rules are. Inside the box, you get two touches, max. You take that two touch here, and you wanna finish it. Last thing that's available to you in the box that will not be available to you outside the box or way far away is a toe poke. The toe bash, toe bomb, okay? You don't wanna use it all the time, but people that tell you not to use it, every single one of you guys in the comment section, I wanna hear you. I wanna, how many times have you been stuck right here and just gone like that? Because you don't have time, that's what it's for, all right? So remember your options. Bend the ball low and hard or far and high. Strike it low right there or the toe bash. Two touches, that's it. Outside the box, let's go. Now, when it comes to being outside of the box, there are a lot of rules, but there's only three that matter. The first one is get as much space as you possibly can, make sure that the ball is rolling forward and away, that you have enough space in between you, and the next is follow through. For the love of God, if you want power on your shot, follow through, land on your kicking foot, whether you're bending or you're striking the ball, all right? And so to make it even easier, you're not gonna have a whole lot of time. But in order to create space, that means the feints, all these things, all that stuff has to happen, you've gotta be good at it. We can't solve that for you in one video, you have to solve it for yourself by training. Once you're there, and once you have that open space, don't hesitate. If you hesitate on a shot, you will lose the opportunity. Take your half chances. The ball can deflect. The goalie might not see it. He might be shielded. Don't be afraid to take a shot. All of these things are so important, and if you can understand them, it will up the percentage of goals that you are scoring, all right? You will not score a goal without shooting, all right? You're not that good if you could just <clears throat> shoot a ball. I mean, I can do it, but I've been training my, so you guys get the point. Last but not least, you have to aim. When you're outside the box, please don't just strike the ball and pray, all right? That won't work. You're gonna get the ball, look up, and even if you can't look up, usually you can see the goalie. I can see out there that there's another goal. I can see where the goalie is, and what I wanna do is decide, all right, he's closer to this side. In that split second, you have enough time to aim towards the other post. Even if you're doing something as crazy as like Rooney taking a half volley from all the way on the other side of the field, Beckham shooting it from behind midfield, the rules are different, but that means you can still try anything. You have nothing to lose if you're gonna try something as crazy as that. And we're not really gonna make a tutorial on how to score from way outside the box because those instances are very rare. Just know, when you're this far outside the box, the knuckleball and that dip are your friends. If you haven't checked out our latest knuckleball video, we'll put the link or something like that. We'll put the thumbnail, it's gonna be here. They'll make it move to this side and they'll make it move back, back over here. Can they do that? We'll see. Point is, you wanna focus on getting the ball on goal, that's it. Give yourself the best chance of scoring from far out. Make sure you take a touch forward out in an angle and whether you're going to hit that knuckleball or you're just going to strike it as hard as you can just remember you are not necessarily aiming for that little tiny corner here and there no hit it with as much power as possible keep your head down and you got it that's the vid my friends leave us a like comment down below subscribe and check out everything from us here at unisport in the description box because we've got the coolest and you know what's coming you know what's coming my friends it's a no look crossbar We'll see you later. <sighs> Nailed it.